hello friends welcome to our channel today we are going to discuss about how to create hypo components in hisys it is a very interesting topic and definitely we will discuss in very elaborative way there are different ways to create hypos in hisys simulation and before we start our discussion i am requesting you guys please subscribe to our channel uh, which will uh, help you to update uh, upcoming videos in future and also you guys uh, want more information on high seas or any psb sizing anything about process engineering related topic you can contact us on this email id process engineering 0605 gmail.com thank you so much let's start the discussion so you have to open the aspen high seas in there to click on this new tab and create new case after clicking on this you will enter in this in this screen on this properties tab first you have to select the fluid package so in today's video we will create the hypos of the hydrocarbon components so i'll select the package the fluid package as ping robinson okay as soon as i select the fluid package i have to click on this view button then i'll enter in this screen here you can see these 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 are the pure components like methane ethane but when you click here you can see the drop down list the second option is hypothetical you have to click on that hypothetical option okay then there are the first method we will discuss the create hypo batch it means there are number of hypos we can create in a single click for that the select will be the hypothetical method will be the create a batch of hypos then there is option like initial boiling point and final boiling point in in what range you have to create the hypos means you have to you can put like from 100 degrees celsius as well from 100 to let's say i want to create hypos up to 500 degrees celsius okay the components which has a boiling point of from 100 to 500 in between i have to create the hypos and interval at what interval you want to create hypos let's say i want to uh, create hypos at each in a 10 degree interval it means at 110 120 until 500 degrees celsius after uh, putting this value just click on this generate hypos hisys will automatically create hypos for you you can see the boiling points in the interval of 10 like 100 10 120 130 40 it will go up to 500 okay and accordingly the molecular weights properties you can see here okay and you can match your uh, components uh, with your requirement so this is the first method to create hypos and so let's say this uh, component or this molecular weight is matching with your requirement then you can simply add this component by clicking here then it will add to your component list for now i'll just remove this so this is the first method now i'll create one more hypo group new hypo group where what what i'll do there is another option there is number of hypos okay so in the range of let's i'll change the range so i'll make it 100 to 200 in this 100 to 200 range i have to create let's say 20 number of hypos okay and after entering the parameter just click on this generate hypos it will create 20 number of hypos between the range of 100 to 200 and you can check your requirement or you can check cross check with your uh, components available with you and after that you can just add whatever components you want in your component lists so this is the second way to generate hypos now i'll discuss the third fee so for that i'll 
create new hypogroup hypogroup 3 okay for that what you need to do you have to select a different method which is create and edit hypos okay and the type will be the base properties here click on the new hypo everything will be blank okay let's say you have some properties with you and you don't know the other properties like liquid density critical temperature critical pressure you only have the normal boiling point and the molecular weight okay so i'll take one example like i have this table from that let's take the first one the normal boiling point is 95.5 okay and the molecular weight is 96 okay uh, and I, let's say I don't have these properties available with me then to estimate the other properties just click on this estimate unknown HiSys will automatically generate the properties and you can compare these properties with whatever uh, available with you you can see in my table the mass density is 727 and estimated value is 722 which is very close it is, which is near to the actual value in this way you can create the hypo components and if you want to edit this hypo you can simply enter the density which you have let's say i have i want to change this 727 i can simply click on that value and put 727 okay again you need to estimate the unknown okay so you can customize the component or as per your way or whatever you want okay and after creating or editing the hypo you can simply add to your component list and you can use this uh, pseudo component or the hypo component in your further simulation process hope you guys uh, get the idea about how to create the hypo components for more information please contact me on this email id process engineering 0605 and please like comment and share the video if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you so much guys